What's up guys? We're headed to O2 Fitness. We're gonna hit some legs today. I'm not gonna lie, I'm still kinda sore from uh, three days ago when I hit legs. I absolutely destroyed my hamstrings. And as well as I tried to jump a fence and the thing I was standing on after I tried to jump the fence slipped and bruised my, <laughs> bruised my entire hamstring. So today is going to be interesting because I'm going to be doing some more hamstring workouts along with some quad focus things just to make sure that I hit all muscle groups inside my leg. <laughs> all right, so Nick is gonna be my cameraman today. He's not feeling too well today. So he's gonna give it a few days and then get back at it. Copyright purposes, I'm not gonna film anything until I get to the gym, but walking in and checking in, stuff like that, we're gonna go ahead and get started. So see you when we get there. Another love. My head is the it's first the airbag. <laughs> Just in the airbag. What are you looking at? This pre workout by itself is actually really good. It's Nutri Authority's uh, Giants Brew, but I put in some creatine and it gives it like this weird tangy taste. So I'm thinking. I'm just gonna down it once we get out of the locker room, or once we get into the locker room, and then we'll get straight into the workout. I'm actually dreading <laughs> my legs today. Um, normally, every day is a leg day, but no. Today, it's like, I'm still kinda sore, but we're gonna get through it. We're not, we're not little, you know the word. <laughs> I'm thinking, start out with just some some lightweight I would say lightweight uh, barbell squats just the bar just 135 just to get my, my legs warmed up and then we're gonna go into machines because today I do not feel like going super heavy on free weights because like I told you I'm super sore so moving these things bit more work than I thought, especially when you can't find the hole. Nick is going to go find the two and a half pound plates. He doesn't want me to rely on the boards because he says that it's overtime is going to like weaken me, so he's found them. <coughs> My back. We had back yesterday. Anyways. We're only gonna do like one set or two sets of like five of this to get my quads warmed up. On this leg extension, we're going to do a drop set pretty much. We're gonna do 10 heavy, cut the weight in half and do an extra 10. Um, my plan says otherwise, but in order to work harder and push myself, that's what I'm gonna do. All right, we got three sets of that. I know by the third set, it's gonna be absolutely horrible. We're gonna go ahead and get that done. Then we're gonna move over to here, the hamstring curls. And after that, we're gonna get into some RDLs and machine squats and stuff like that. So next we have the leg curl. Not gonna go too, too heavy on this one, just because of how bad I worked in the other day. Um, so I'm gonna go about 130 uh, instead of like 200, something like that. So I'll go about 130 for about 15 reps, pausing. My friend Nate taught me a better way to do leg curls. If you lean forward, like at your hip, like bend at your waist, what that does is it, it lengthens and stretches out your hamstring, causing you to have a better contraction. See on these, you're gonna wanna focus on the eccentric movement. You're gonna wanna slowly extend, but explode on the contraction. But working on that resistance is gonna keep your muscle under tension, which is gonna help you build muscle faster. We got some RDLs. I do them a little different. I have knee and lower back pain. So what I'm gonna do is I put my toes up, I put my toes up on the, uh, on the plates here. So I have an elevation. And then what that allows me to do is stretch out my hamstring, which allows me to contract it more on the way up. I'm in the process of tightening up my legs, getting them more lean. 
feel like that looks decent so far, but we'll get there. That's brutal, especially if you go down slow. Keep that back straight, engage the hamstrings. Yes, you're gonna work your lower back, but my focus is lower glute, upper hamstring. So give that a try. Let me know in the comments what you think. Got two more exercises. Got the free motion squat, and then we got calf raises. Pretty gassed right now, especially from the RDLs. You know it's bad when you start sweating from your shins and it starts driven. Got a good pump right now. About to hit these, uh, about to hit these squats. I'm gonna do like three sets. I'm gonna show y'all how deep I go, and then I'm gonna call it from there. Put my feet a little bit in front of me so I focus on not only the quads but some of the glutes and hams as well. I'm, I'm gonna start working on not breaking 90. Like I'm gonna go right here, come up instead of all the way down because then that takes the pressure off my hamstrings. <sighs> All right, so I'm gonna do three sets of eight, and then see all the calf raises. Change of plans, we're gonna hit calf raises on the leg press, and then I'm going to hit body weight, uh, body weight elevated squats, so like my heels are gonna be elevated. I'm gonna do like three sets of 20, 25. For now, we're gonna just kill some calf raises. I'm gonna do like three sets of 20. Um, my calves look decent, but try to get them more cut. Last thing we got is just body weight, uh, heel elevator squats, like I said. We're gonna do three sets of like 20 to 25, and I'm just gonna do them controlled. I mean, if I go a little fast, it's fine. I'm just trying to burn the, burn the quads out and finish it off, and then I'll get y'all some posing after I get done. Yeah, I'm gonna just do 20. Woo, burnt. I didn't get it on camera, but last set, one of our friends, very good at pushing people. Maybe grab an 80, do 20 reps, drop it, go to failure. It's horrible, but let's go ahead and get some posing in. We completed our leg session. Do I want to die? I'm not gonna say that on YouTube, but yes. Um, <laughs> I'm absolutely shaking. I don't know if you can tell or not, but I'm drenched. I, have, I didn't go in the sauna today. Um, it feels absolutely amazing outside though. Uh, so what we're gonna do is I'm gonna go home. I gotta pack. I'll be gone for the weekend, so you'll be seeing me back up here coming next week. But we're gonna start doing more long form content. I do only TikToks and Instagram reels, so. I'll start recording more things like this so y'all can be engaged, all my YouTube uh, subscribers. And uh, after that, it's only up from here. If y'all enjoyed this workout today or if y'all enjoyed this vlog, let me know what you thought in the comment section. Hit that subscribe button, hit that thumbs up and that little bell so you'll be notified next time I post a video. Peace.